it's amazing to be in the army rather than being stuck in a factory, which I was for the last six years. Squad! Squad! One, two, three! The best thing for me is knowing that I have a good future ahead and the things that's going on, which the army involved in, like Afghanistan and stuff. I'll be able to sit when I'm older and say, yeah, I was there, knowing that I was part of something. A bit of pride as well. What I want to see is your arm at a 90 degree angle from your body. This will enable your weapon to be at a 45 degree angle. When I left school, I left with nothing. Didn't sit my GCSEs. It didn't appeal to me then. In lessons, I would rather have sat there and not asked questions, whereas I wouldn't have been learning. I wanted to go straight into a factory, just earn the cash, really. You just have your good days and you get your bad days. Some days you get up and then you look at the board. And when you see PT, it starts to, to go downhill. Before I came into the Army, I knew there was facilities and I knew I would have been learning, but not as much. I knew there was tutors and stuff to teach English and maths, but I didn't think the Army was more dedicated, you know, into teaching you. But when I came here and I was like shocked that, God, I'm getting tests, you know. You should be able to fire your weapon at 300 metres and hit a target. The Taliban have been trained to fire their weapons at 400 metres. That gives uh, the Taliban an advantage of what? Exactly. The Maz comes into judging distance, target reference. When you're using comms, you use Maz nearly every day. Working out anything, really. 50. I do Maz when I have time off. I have like, a Maz trainer. I can just chill and basically just play the DS but I'm learning, I'm learning constantly playing it. I know it's getting explained, you know, in class, but I can go back after and just do it, and just do it and do it, and just keep on doing it, and that's what's making it stick in my head. I, I have two boys, so now my oldest fella will be four. He'll be getting into school, coming home with homework, and I'll be able to sit there and say, yes, no, that goes there, you know, and, and help him, whereas, I had no maths at all. Be able to know that I can teach him, it puts a smile on my face. It makes me know that I can go and do things. So if I put my head to it, I can go and grab it.